Hi everyone, welcome to Naresh Technologies. This is Srinivas. So, in this session, we are going to discuss one interview question in Core Java that is in threads concept. So, what is that? Question is so why the run method cannot throws interrupted exception. See, so while writing thread programming, so you will face this problem definitely, right? This question will rise. So, means what? For example, whenever we are overriding run method, so in the thread logic, so thread logic mostly we will face, we will place inside the run method only, right? Inside the run method only, we will place the entire thread logic. Here, Suppose if you want to so put that code into the sleep mode means what thread into the sleep mode or if you want to join with another thread any code you want to write. So, best example sleep method is a thread dot sleep method because sleep method is a static method is available in a thread class and here it is we need to pass some time interval right in milliseconds we have to pass. For example, if you want to put it in a uh, means what if you want to put the thread in a uh, sleep mode for one second here it is we need to pass the thousand milliseconds thousand milliseconds is equals to one second but here it is whenever you are calling sleep method sleep method is throwing one exception exception is a interrupted exception but here we need to understand that interrupted exception is a checked exception so what is that checked exception means what so handling is mandatory so two options you have either you can handle or you can pass it to the next level. So, nothing but exception handling process. So, object we can pass it to the next level to be handled. But here it is in this case, in this case if you do not want to handle, so whenever we are calling the sleep method generally we will try to throws that exception, throws interrupted exception, but here it will not allow, you cannot throw. So, why sir, what is the reason? The reason is run method is a overridden method. So, means what? So, run method is available in a runnable interface and of course, that is implemented by the thread class with a empty, so with empty definition. So, we know all the things basics. So, now whenever we are overriding with a thread logic, thread logic how they defined in the same way we should override. So, means what, what one syntactical rule of overriding is we should not supposed to change the prototype of the method, how they defined exactly in a runnable interface in the same way you should override. So, you have to write only public void run, you should not supposed to add extra prototype, this is not allowed. So, means what as we cannot throws only one option you have, you should handle, you must handle in the run method. So, that is thread dot sleep means you must place inside the try catch and we need to handle that interrupted exception as it was a checked exception. So, handling is compulsory. So, any uh, logic handling logic we will place here. This is the reason. So, why we cannot throws means what why run method cannot throws interrupted exception. So, while writing the thread logic in a run in run method. Okay. So, hope you understood well. For more videos, please subscribe to Naresh IT channel. Thank you. Thank you all.